BT7 pre-release is happening right now for the weekend. And like always, we got a booster box opening for all of you. Hello Digimon players and fans, welcome back to another Digimon opening video. BC7 Next Adventure introduces many supports for hybrids and it actually focuses on the Digimon Frontier anime series. If you guys want to find out the next best decks to play in this format, then definitely subscribe as we've got many deck profiles for BT7 coming up real soon. Also be sure to give this video a like as it really helps with the YouTube algorithm. Since it is pre-release weekend, we also got four pre-release packs to open up. So let's just get right into it. Okay, so let's start off with the next adventure pre-release packs first. I think, uh, yeah, two cards per pack. I don't know what's exactly that good inside here, but I guess we'll find out. Uh, okay, so the first one we got a Beetleman pre-release. Uh, and then we got a Skull Knightmon. So it's pretty nice because like all the uncommon and the common cards, they hollowed it up with this pack, just like last time. So they don't do the, they don't do the engraving stuff anymore. Kind of sucks. Yeah. <laughs> but I actually like, I like, I like the looks of these more. They actually look more rare to me. We got a Rihimon. And we have a Dino Rexmon. This card is actually an ex body. Is it? Yeah. I don't know why though. Maybe it has X in it. When did you move in? Suspend one of your opponents to you move in. That is wrong. Does it unsuspend during the next unsuspend phase? So like puppet mine. Yeah, we got Jet Silphie Mon. Oh, that's good. For the yellow guys. Oh, we got the Chaos Dramon. That's that's for Digivolving on top of uh. Was she Dramon? Yeah. Here, take a look. It costs four. Machine Dramon can Digivolve on top. Okay, last pack. Kokomon. And then we have a Metal Cannon. Okay, so here's the booster box. Nyx Adventure BT7. Honestly, BT6 felt like it was just a few weeks ago. Like, we were opening that really not too long but you know new set new games new decks that's definitely something i'm looking forward to so yeah susanomon deck let's go susanomon every deck needs susanomon oh i got zoe i got zoe for my and then here for our promotion pack we this is basically the pack that gives you like the memory boosts. Okay, this is basically exactly the same as TK, but specifically for hybrid. Right. And cost one less. I got green memory boost. Salad eating salads. Not, not bad. All right, first pack. Let's go. Postmon, Nemon. Blue Hawaii Death. Uh, Brave Metal, definitely need it for the Dorugamon uh, removal card. Aizmon, limit to one. Boutmon, Tuskmon, Kokomon, a Nidhogmon in purple. Uh, Fire Drake Strike, Koji, and then we got Metal Cannon. Uh, Metal Cannon, yep, I think we pulled it earlier for pre release, and we need that for the X Antibody deck, anyways. Are you building one? Yes, I'm definitely building X Antibody. Uh, Gigasmon, the hybrid for black, the, the one that costs three to Digivolve. Orochimon, Postmon, Wamon, Nimon, Toyagumon, Deadly Axemon, Stefomon, Pusurimon, Rhino Kabuterimon, Lopmon, and then, oh! I got it. I got the Dorugaramon. It's super rare? Yeah, it's just a super rare. Doru, Dorugaramon. But yeah, definitely the card I'm looking for because this is basically the ex-antibody. 
um, your turn for each card with X antibody and its traits, this Digimon basically gains a uh, thousand DP. When attacking, I can place one card with X antibody and its traits from my hand to the bottom of this Digivolution card sources and delete two of your opponent's Digimon with play cost less than or equal to this uh, Digimon's Digivolution card, which is really, really good. And then, yeah, that's that's the card that needs it and then pairs up very well with Alphamon. Uh, Thunder Laser, oh, uh, Wendigomon, Kazemon, uh, Kingwamon, Huckmon, upgrade for the Jessmon deck, Eismon Scatter Mode, Metal Kabutari, Eosmon. Eosmon? Yeah, but uncommon and not even hollow at all. What? It's the same card though, right? No, I think it's no, different. No, it's different. It's a new effect. Yeah, all your other Eosmon gains 1000 DP, you may delete one level 5 and lower Eosmon from your hand. Hey look, it's it's a part of Greek Gomamon. On, yeah, oh no, no when played. Oh, when, when played. Play from... I see. Aldomon, Ooh. Zoe, and. E oh, Emperor oh. Greymon. That matches yours. Holy cats, nice. That matches your. your uh, the other one. <laughs> Which one? The one that you pulled. The Altar. Oh. The one that's yours, like five cents. Is it? <laughs> Who wants to play that card? I do. It's terrible. I'll, I'll play. I'll play blue uh, hybrid. Need to level five. I'll play blue yeah. hybrid. Nice Ghostmon, Saber Leomon, Kendogar, and new Kendogar. At first, I thought it was Susanomon because I saw like some red on the side. Oh really? <laughs> Susanomon. No, Susanomon is all gold. Oh, the altar, yeah. Yeah, the Rugamon. Uh, no, I definitely need it. Giga Storm. Uh, Ultra Turbulence, uh, Kumamon, the new hybrid tamer that's gonna replace Lobomon essentially because this is basically better than Lobomon. It has 1k less DP, but it has an, it has an effect where you can just trash uh, when digivolving, which is pretty good. Uh, Rihimon, Persimon, Zephyrmon, Ancient, Mega, Mega Thurimon. And then we got Emperor Greymon to oh, match no. our just now. I kind of do want to play like Ancient Grey now, but I don't even have any of the Ancient Grey cards. Except, uh, yeah, I have everything I think except for the Ancient Grey Mon. And this guy's only the sub guy. You, you still play Ancient Grey as your main. This this is like your secondary level six, I think. Tuskmon, Starlight Velocity, Doru Grey Mon, Koichi Kimura, and Zoe again. Double tamer. Double tamer. I think I... I guess now that we only have the secret rare left, I guess Susanomon is the goal. Kazemon, Wedigamon. Uh, Korikakumon is also a new hybrid, uh, which is really cool. Portalmon, Gigastorm, Jet Sylphimon, Beowulfmon. Oh, so this is the level 5 that you did evolve. Uh, the Magna. Is that what you use to attack? I think so. Is that yeah. what attacking? Yeah. Effect? But you can play the older one, because the older one has jamming. But I, I don't know if it's like that good. You may, when attacking, you may return one card with hybrid in the straight from the Digimon Digivolution cards to your hand. You return one of your opponents level 4 lower Digimon cards to your hand. Deadly Axemon, Tortomon, and Tilamon, Gotsumon. This is actually referenced back to the anime. Oh, with, is it? With the Pumpkinmon as friends. Korikakumon, Grumbomon, this is the Black Tamer. I mean, not Black Tamer, Black Hybrid that everyone needs. Oh. The Digivolve, like the Black Lobo, and then the attack. There's something good at the back, I think. Black Lobo? Rhino. It's like the Black version of Lobo. Oh, Black version of Lobo. I was like, yeah. there's a Black version of Lobo. No, because you just digivolve on top of a tamer and then you just attack. It's two costs. Yeah, it's two costs. exactly. Pokemon, Dorogurumon, Metal. Oh, oh, I got a Susanomon! Susanomon, here it is. Secret rare. That's it for the opening because we pulled our Altar and the secret rare. <laughs> Didn't get the tamer Digimon yet. Tamer Digimon. It's a tamer Digimon card. Oh, yeah. That's true. Uh, I think I pulled one earlier. Oh, maybe I didn't see. Uh, Boutmon, oh, Metal, Kabuteri, Tidal Wave, Philmon, Icemon, oh, Scatamon, yeah. Grumblemon, Triceramon, Mami Tyranamon, Di 
Dai Penman and then Metal Garu. That's Metal nice. Guys. These yeah. are new effects essentially because uh, they do new things. When Digivolving, you get to, if you have a Tamer, you get to draw two. Once per turn, this uh, opponent's turn, sorry, this Digimon can't be attacked. Yeah. They have completely new effects. I don't know how playable they are though. I mean, at least it, it can protect itself. Actually, not too bad, the effect. Yeah. For three costs, you draw two cards and it protects itself. Yeah. Monochromon. Flame, mem flame Memory Boost. Yeah. That's like the same as the Howling Memory Boost uh, art. Plus one security attack, yeah. Oh, okay. Shellmon, Bulkmon, Loimon, Brachiomon, Kokomon, Beetlemon. Dead or Alive. Qual How do you pronounce this? Qualialis? What? What is that? What kind of word is that? Qualialis. Qualialis Blast. Yeah, I can't pronounce it. Good. It looks like there's a lot of like tamer and option rares. Yeah. And yeah. a lot less like Digimon rares. Yeah, in this set for sure. Shaomon, Brachiomon, Thunder Laser, Schwartz, or Harps, Kendogar, Ghostmon, Monitamon, Beetlemon, Kaiser Leomon, Dorimon, Systemon, Xiao Awakened, and then there's the War Greymon to partner up with our Metal Greymon. That way, folks. That's pretty good. What does this one do? If you have a team where you play, delete one of your opponent's Digimon with 13,000 DP or less. What did you want? I'll cost four though. I'll right. cost four? Yeah, when attacking, delete something 4,000 or less. So, okay, so the fact kind of sucks. Right. Dino Memory Boost. Interesting. Monotamon, Bakumon. This is what you need for all the hybrid type of decks. Triceramon, Nemon, Beowulfmon, and then we have uh, Koda, Demoto. This is definitely needed for the X-Antibody. This is like the new memory tamer for black and for X-Antibody, essentially. Oh. Not bad opening so far, though. Not bad, yeah. Definitely not bad. I I'll take Susano Mon any day. Thoughts of, is it dropping or not? You think it's gonna drop? It will drop. You think so? A little bit, yeah. Especially because you can't play Mega Digimon Fusion. But, uh, uh Star Mod didn't really drop that much, comparatively speaking. That's true. Avenge Kidma, I thought this was gonna be like a R or SR, but it's just a rare. It's an uncommon. I mean, uncommon, sorry. You you play this as a side deck card against <laughs> Three Musketeers. Uh, we got this one earlier, we got Takuya, Kambara. Oh, Kambara. wow! It, it <laughs> when playing this card from your hand, reduce the memory cost by one for each option card in you and your opponent's trash. Yeah. On play, return all three Musketeers in their traits and option cards from both players' trashes to the bottom of their deck. Holy cow! It's a, <laughs> it's, a, it's, a, it's a total counter to anything Musketeers. Yeah. Evolution Ancient. I think this is like the Mega Digimon Fusion for, for the hybrid uh, ancient stuff. And then Dino Rexmon, we pulled it in our pre-release pack earlier. Avenge Kidmon, what a funny card. They actually built one card to counter all of the entire deck. I'm, can you actually play this card in Three Musketeers? Isn't that at the whole point as well? You could, yeah. I mean, but then you, you don't have a follow-up turn though. Uh, Right? Fannymon. Oh, that's nice. Wedkari. Classic art. Not bad. The effect's not too bad. The red the red gray one definitely affects the worst one. Bakumon, Monochromon, Kumamon, Schwartz. Yeah, we're seeing most like repeats already. Koromon, Takuya. Where Gurumon? I really like this art, it looks pretty cool. Oh. Looks really angry. Almost doesn't look like him. Yeah, it doesn't look like him. I thought, like, it kind of looked a bit like Strabimon as well. Yeah. Orochi, Gatsu, King Waman, Metal Kabuteri, Starlight, Burning Grey, Mugen, Betamon, and then another system on Xiao Awakened. Okay. Yeah, I'll play Jessamon in BT7. Tamer's very, the red Tamer's very interesting. It's basically just a shortcut to Emperor Greymon. Oh, really? It doesn't do anything else. It has no other effects. Tuskmon, Scatter Mode, Dino, Dorugamon, 
Brachio Triceramon, Ancient Volcanomon, Zephyrmon, Evolution, Ancient, and then Rosenmon. This is a completely new Digimon. Like, very new Digimon. Like, they made it up? Like, recently, like a year ago, I think? Not Maybe not even, maybe even less than a year ago, this Digimon was created. I didn't even know they make new Digimon. Yeah, they still do. Like, Pulsemon is actually very new. It looks like Goku's hair. Yeah. <laughs> like, it went like Super Saiyan or something. Yeah. Dead or Alive and then Cherubimon. Oh, Cherubimon's good. Yeah? Because it's the least tamers, isn't it? Or no, was no, it? No, 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 that, that's Musamon. Oh, okay, never mind. This one is basically swarming the board. So when you Digivolve, you can play a purple tamer for free from your trash. Right. And then on Delete, you can, for every purple tamer, or for every tamer you have actually, not just purple, any tamer, you can play one level three Digimon from your trash. Huh. On Delete. So basically, you do Digivolve once and then swing it, hopefully it dies, and then swarm the board for the next turn. Mm hmm. Ebon Woman. Yeah, I'm not playing. Some of those cards are never gonna get played. Yeah. <laughs> this is the Rosenmon's yes. lore form. Yes. You can tell. Yes, it is. The growing Mohawk. Lowy, Kendo, Brachio, Bulkman, Bako, Shell, Antilo, Eos, Goma, Aldo, and then we got oh. Bikeman. So we got all four, essentially. That is cool. Uh, Dorumon is definitely what I needed for the ex-antipody. It's basically like the searcher. That looks like the first one. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Well, I think it looks like it does. I think it is my first one. That's basically the Huckmon for the deck, essentially. So you basically open everything. All yeah. Value yes. In the box. Yes. So everything left is just SRs at this moment. Yas Strabi and an ancient Kazemon. Do you actually play this in the yellow uh hybrid? No, yeah. I've never seen him. Shine Grey making a comeback though. I mean I don't think it's bad. Oh it costs five though. I don't know. It kinda costs too much. All the ancient costs five actually. Yeah, but it kinda costs too much for what it does. The other the other one's bet. The new the BT eight one or BT nine one, the one that recovers. Right. It's better. JP and then Metal Greymon. If you have a Tamer and play, gain two memory. If you don't have a Tamer and play, you can play Red Tamer from your hand without paying memory costs. That's pretty good. That's not bad. It can help you on Brick. But it's on play. I know, but like, it'll be a five cost level five, which is a pretty good deal for yeah. 7,000. Yeah. King Wamon, Brave Metal, Flame, Memory Boost, Saber Leomon. Nidhogg, and then we got Sissamon Blanc Awaken, and then we got Ancient Beetlemon. Are you interested in green? No. Hybrid? But the Tamer is actually pretty good. Yeah, green hybrid is actually gonna be really good. The green hybrid reduced the cost by one, so you can still do over two, you can for one. Yeah. Alright, last pack, final pack. And it does piercing. It does the inherited. Oh, yeah? I didn't even look into the green at all. I'm just reading it now. <laughs> okay, well, that's it. That'll be it for our BT7 Nyx Adventure opening for today. If you guys enjoyed the video, please give it a like. Did any of you guys open this set for yourself? What cards are you guys most looking forward to this set? Be sure to share them with everyone in the comments down below. Like I mentioned earlier, we got lots of deck profiles coming up that will be focusing on the BT7 format. So be sure to subscribe and turn on that notification bell to stay tuned. As always, thank you so much for watching. You guys have a great day, great night, wherever you are. See you in the next video. This is Bob, signing out.